Okay, here we go again. Good gravy, what have you put together for me to say this time? There has been an evolution within me. I now realize there can only be true greatness when perfect balance and harmony is achieved. When Ying and Yang meet as equals. When the two Reinhardt disciplines meet together to create a stronger whole. In my final stage of growth, before I can fully burst from my cocoon, I must bring forth the unyielding power of the hammer swing. I must learn to wield its true power and control it in its most pure form. I can allow no distractions, no safety nets or shields, no trump cards or escape plans. I cannot allow myself to waver. To fall back on my abilities would show weakness. I will march forward to meet the enemy. I will show them their damage doesn't frighten me. That it only makes me stronger. That it will only bring them closer to their demise. They will meet my gaze and find no trace of mercy, no trace of hesitation, no hope of escape. For the hammer swing will meet all with its unrelenting blows equally. They will all be equal piles of dust beneath my mallet. Like time itself, it will bring all things to crumble before it. Like herding wild cattle, I know their weaknesses, I know their mindset, and I will round them all up. I will force them into walls and back them towards a precipice. I will pressure them into hard places and then I will be the rock. The unstoppable force and the immovable object intertwined as one. I will soak up their bullets and arrows and rockets like nothing. I will show no flinching moment or retreat. For I know the full possibility of their damage potential. I know that even with the most perfect precision they cannot outpace the mighty hammer. For what reason is there to try when the timer is already up? when the outcome is already set in stone. There is no headshot that can save them. There is no movement they can make that I have not already accounted for. Why must they still sweat and toil? Why must they show me such great disrespect? Why can't they accept their fate? Surely they can see I am no ordinary Reinhardt cowering in the corner behind my shield. Surely they can see the layers of wear on my hammer see the many marks of countless souls cut down by it. But still they try, still they persevere, there is no healer coming to save them, no mercy to resurrect them, no shield or bubble to hide them. Don't worry my little friends, I will gladly put you out of your misery, I will free you of your inadequacy, I will free you of your denial, you will be safe in the sweet embrace of my hammer. Doesn't it look so alluring, so shiny and gold? You could spend a lifetime admiring it, worshipping it, doing its bidding. It's just so much fun. It's just so easy. Just swing the hammer, let it spin and sway around me, feel its weight, feel the strength it gives. Only the hammer can make me happy, it's all I need, it's all I will ever need. The shield made me a coward, but now I am brave. The charge made me desperate, but now I feel safe. The fire strike made me lazy, but now I'm getting my cardio. Now I know the future, now I know I can just count. One, two, three and all my problems are sent flying away. Every swing is like a new layer of fresh warm lasagna to dig into. The hammer is my friend, it talks to me, I hear it sing with each smash against my foes. I hear it chime and ring with every arisios in yatta that gets in its way. The hammer can make me fly. The hammer can make me soar away like a rocket. I will journey through the earth to show all the love it has shown me. I will recruit many for its cause. I will build an army for it. I will teach others to love it the way I do, by any means necessary. I would gladly give everything for it. I would carry it over any mountain, over any obstacle, to even the darkest depths of Mordor itself. I can feel the hammer's wishes and desires mixing with the core of my very soul. I am one with the hammer. I can feel the wind swirling around it with every swing. I feel the sun's light bouncing off it, as though unworthy of it. My eyes are filled with the golden shine. My heart is gold, my blood is gold. We are inseparable, don't you dare try touching it, don't you dare even look at it. It's mine. It can only ever be mine. No one understands it like I do. It speaks only to me. It trusts only me. You could never unlock its true power like me. You could never serve it like me. 
It's mine, and I am it. It is my. It is my. It is my dearest, my treasured, my adored, my precious. Thank you for watching. While we finish this game up I have still got a little bit of time left on this text to speech free trial so here are a few more silly and outrageous phrases for it to say. A woodchuck could and does chuck around 10 cubic meters of dirt in the course of digging a burrow. It can therefore be reasoned that if a woodchuck could chuck wood, he would chuck an amount equivalent to the weight of the dirt, or 318 kilograms. My idea for phones, with pre-cracked screens is bound to take off. If I'm smart I can buy lots of loot boxes now so I don't get any of those annoying Christmas skins. I am so sick of people asking me to play a damage hero in competitive. My Steam library of over 350 games is in no way excessive. Changing around the voices I use will definitely not kill any of the immersion I've built up. I should really help familiarize my audience with long suspenseful pauses. It will save me so much time on writing. 